Okay, so I made it to the end of the uh, deeper level, subconscious, whatever it's called. <laughs> oh, yeah. Let's see what I achieved here. Shotgun kills, defiance, behemoth kills, yeah, and then just the rest working on. So let's see what happens when we quote-unquote beat the game on the higher difficulty. So here's all my stuff. Got a lot of stuff for explosions. I'm, I'm running it about around an hour and, and change as far as uh, my runs are concerned here. Okay, so last time we did this, we left through the portal and then came all the way over here, so... Now let's see. And with everything you've been through, I owe you the truth. The back door you just accessed in my subconscious was installed by the consortium after I stole this hellish device on behalf of Bureau 5. Huh. Call it an insurance policy. Now it's activated, you could be pretty sure they're targeting everything they've got at our location, and any freedom you just won will be pretty short-lived unless you can get off the island PDQ. Mm-hmm. And hey, look, you can go if you like. But I want to offer you compensation against Bureau 5 and their Viper Sorensen who left you for dead and who treated me and my fallen comrades like data points in an archive formula. You have the chance to put right what is wrong, to defy for the greater good. Uh, now the backdoor protocol is enabled, my mind is a conduit from the Bureau 5 database to the people they wronged. Not only that, but if you jump deep into my mind one last time and progress back to the center, you can bust me out of here. You can defeat the machine, and then together we can destroy Bureau 5. Meanwhile, with the back door activated, I believe I'll be able to reach an old friend who owes me a favor and owns a helicopter. Hmm. Nice. Okay. One more go around, I suppose. It's not the end of your journey. Repressed level access granted. A difficulty increased. All right. So, so far, uh, with how the difficulties of get revenge and destroy nope. this infernal device, you'll need to access memories deeper than anything you've seen before, which means resistance like you've never known. Equip yourself carefully before stepping back into my mind. Got it. So Advanced proficiency demonstrated. Awaiting operator review. So I have subtitles turned on in my game but I don't think they actually show up on the recording for some reason. I asked the devs on like Twitter and stuff like that. I haven't heard anything back yet, so it could just be a bug. It could also just be where, I don't know, what real estate you guys are allowed to see on the screen in any given moment. Like if the bottom of the screen is cut off, you guys might not be able to see it, but I don't know. Either way, um, I think, uh, yeah, I think that uh, me clearing that last difficulty level was done the run after I had uh, unlocked all this stuff um, and unlocked the first difficulty increase, that kind of a thing. Because your enemy cannot predict your response. Mm -hmm. New upgrades available. Okay, so didn't do that yet. Got the behemoth kills. That's done. Shotgun kills are done. In a single run, kill at least one enemy with each weapon type. That should be pretty easy. Finish the game on deep memory. Oh, and then there's just repre repress that's left for that. Uh, so I don't have too, too much more to do. The killing enemies with their own grenade is going to take a little bit, though. It's a little annoying. That's okay, though. We don't have too many more upgrades to do, either. Uh, probably... How much do I have? 21? Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Uh, yeah, sure, we'll increase the HP, why not? Uh, I'm probably not going to do this run. Got to go to bed soon, but I will uh, kind of check it out. Because I'm curious what level enemies are going to start at in this next little go around. Yeah, let's take transmission. I like transmission. Okay, what do we got? 
Still level one. Took a bit of damage, but whatever. I never saw soldiers in her spreadsheets. And in soldiers, only saw numbers. Mm hmm. I bet I could get the, uh, the whole get a kill with every weapon in one run thing. Let's see, what do they give us? Perfect. Just take that. Alright, then I just gotta get a shotgun. And that's it. I'll take patience. Patience is good. Really matter, I guess, but we'll take that. Arrival at subconscious in seven zones. Open fire. I just... Okay, there's those two weapons done. <laughs> All right, shotgun? Perfect. Okay. Yeah. Take that. Grenade launcher is way too good, by the way. Moving to position Bravo. Come on. <laughs> Is that everything? I think that was everything. At least one enemy with each weapon type. Okay, it's only telling me I have two. That's interesting. All right. That's what patience does with this. Splits it into like a 
a multi, like a cluster grenade. Cool. Ah! <laughs> Now, it's still on two. Why are you still on two? Unless it doesn't count your starting weapons. Never escape us. I was sent on a mission to capture a man Sorensen wanted for questioning. Not to make the world safe. Let's see. Yeah, it still says two. Huh. But to share ideas on psychology. Slingshot. Nah, I don't really like I slingshot that much. To be honest. Damage a major terrorist organization by putting a bullet between his eyes. Sorensen never accepted my story, and from then on, I was expendable to Bureau of Five. Uh huh. Whatever you say, David Hater. I miss the... I oh, guess not. Okay. Oh, all right. Okay. Sure. Neuroconvergence. Why not? It's always fun. Arrival at subconscious. All right. Still says two out of four. So, we might have to find the weapon drop and find something. Twenty-four HP. Oh. Okay. 
Still at two out of four. Yeah, maybe I have to pick up the weapon first, and then it'll give me credit for the kill. Who knows? No. Alright, speaking of, I need to go find the weapon. Yeah, if you didn't know you could go past those, you can. <laughs> you just gotta climb. <laughs> Shotgun. Sure. Shop. Which I really want to go for right now. Uh, hypnosis. Let's do volatility. and the floodgates to Bureau 5's database will be wide open. What? You wouldn't dare. Colonel, we're making an unscheduled visit to the island. If we can't switch you off remotely, I'll do it in person. I'm less than a hundred clicks away. Are you ready for instructions? Huh. We will be. Getting a little, getting a little rowdy. That's okay though. Oh, you didn't die. But now, that's what I thought. Oh, thank you. I might die. That's okay. Doesn't even seem like my the thing I was even going for is working properly, so I don't know. Surprising. <laughs> 18 HP. I was really sure he's gonna kill me. Right. Eh. I guess we could die in the boss fight. No big deal. Bring it on! <laughs> How have you not killed me yet? <laughs> I think that was actually my own explosion that did it. Eh, whatever. That's okay. <laughs> uh, that's funny. So yeah, there's the second difficulty down. I just need to uh, 
God knows how much firepower pointed our way. I need you to get all the way through my mind one last time. You got it. Get right on that eventually. Get at least one enemy with each weapon type. I mean, could have sworn I did that, but okay. That's fine, I guess. Okay, well, anyway, I'll see you guys in the next episode. I'm sure uh, once I beat the game again, I'll, uh, you know, at least record the very, very end so that way you guys can see it. But uh, anyway, I'll see you in the next one. Uh, bye bye.